change things too much up in the lineup. Love the EE1Ds still being here for Lion. Also love that Ask has thrown one of these Prismas outside. So very annoying to deal with when you're an offender, that constant blinking right in front of your eyes. Say rotation from karaoke bedroom and office. Nade goes out from Renshiro. Is this where it begins? BDS will take no prisoners as they break into the kitchen and barbecue bomb sites and realize this Sam, they have it for the taking. There's nobody there. And suddenly BDS is cleaning up. This could be the downfall of it all, Parker. Bride, he's going to get the plant. It's a three versus four. Oh my, BDS! A tour de force from BDS. They are your major champions. To wait and potentially go for a flank. Exploit whatever blind spot there might be. DZ has vacated the bomb site. Diffuser going down in the hands of Iconics. Does DZ know this? It's being planted right under their very noses. One missed opportunity for Eclipse. Hyper goes oh. up. Suddenly DZ have the advantage, but they got to work against the clock. DP Fire nestled firmly inside of the bomb site. His teammate J90 guns down Eclipse. Repositioning, running rampant as DZ will scramble. Hyper with one on DP Fire. It's J90 to save Astralis. DZ can double up and secure their first international major win. They were forged in the south. How fitting it is that the first international trophy is earned in the south. Dark Zero win the Charlotte Major. Storm down in the middle of the bomb site are the FaZe Clan members. They still have one Nitro Cell at their disposal and will likely rec be receiving information from Cameraman about what to do next. And it'll go off, pulled maybe a bit too early as he governs over the hatch. Looking towards White Stairs, knowing there's a body there, but the pre-fire will not connect. Muzi still poised to work towards the bomb site from that exact angle. Nip know they have an advantage, but they cannot start to lose pace. And the momentum might be going in favor of FaZe Clan. They're watching very intensely with the guns on both sides working out very effectively. A drop from Psycho inside of Laundry. Julio taking some damage and the plant will start to go down. It's now a 2v3. FaZe have everything in their power and that's the Diffuser. Years and years of hard work pay off for the Brazilian squad and five gentlemen earn their first major here in Sweden. FaZe Clan are your champions. A real five map war to get us to this on the downstairs. Last 15, it's literally now or never. Spoy finds one, two left standing. The plant's gonna get stuck. They find the down as well. Yesterday, they took the crown from LA. Today, they take the kingdom from Lockdown. And he needs to get a pick off of this, or they're just going to have to funnel into a disadvantage in terms of manpower. You also have Alamau on the roam. That's going to be a major factor later in the round. The fact that he is going to be down there as a nuisance, where they won't see him, they won't know he's there, and Empire don't have the bodies to commit to a flank watch. When Shepard goes to get that diffuser down, always will need to be the one to watch for the remaining three players from Team One. It took about a miracle for Team One to get here, and with always taking some more damage, it looks like Team One have it within their grasp. A small entry point for Team Empire to get in, and they'll fight back and forth. Levy doesn't see it. Oh. Down goes Ali Mao. All it is is Lagonis in a 1v2, as Empire need to get that diffuser down. Five seconds left, but it's been surrendered. And do oh. you believe in magic, Michael? Because I do, and Team One does, as they win the Mexico Major. Parker, they are that team. Of the BR6. That's what could happen here very soon if they play their cards right. Nest holds on towards the stairway, firing off warning shots and trying to keep them paranoid about pushing down. They've got their multiple angles opened up at this point and they are ready to make a final attack. But team one, you gotta hit your shots, Tim. No room for error now. Smoke's being dropped in from the top. Last minute reinforcements going down and Ness gets off the nitro. Luckily, Felipox hadn't fully committed to the drop or he would have been taking a long dirt nap. 
And this really puts the pressure on them as Nest peeks out. It's all going wrong, Tim. We're in a 4v2. Team one might be out of the major as they get shut down by Palu. He lets his guy explode and lays all those busters down. It's GG as Liquid are crowned the champions of the six major. They've done it. They've came, they've seen, and they have conquered Tim. A seven to three victory over team one. A big tower could fall back. Ooh. You know, D2. They're creeping down Freezer. They're creeping down Freezer. Might they do exactly what happened to Herds? There's a cross that's there. Oh. Ali Mao is waiting. He wants to distract. And there's Virtue to come to the rescue. Two separate players from G2 and Freezer 2 over by Tower. They spot one towards Pillar. JV in trouble. Benja, the very first pick. Two follow very quickly. Nitro Cell goes out, KZ rushing in, G2 looking to accomplish this one kill away, and it's Volps to die! A new generation pick up where Legends left off! G2 again! World Champions! Look at Dogi's face. That's a face that says, I cannot believe it. And they've only got two more bodies to find. The smoke of Shepard is down below. Joystick, where does he sit? That's the question. Watching for a repel, potentially for one on the roof. He could engage, but he gets smoked by Achieved. It's a 5v1. If there's ever been the time for a flawless round, it's now. Everything on the line for TSM. What a year it's been from them. And it's all now Shepard to try and stop it. Empire have come so close before, but they've fallen short and they'll do so again. TSM said, trust the process. The process just won you a world championship. TSM are your sixth invitational 2022 world champs. On the primary floor, presence above, hatch above, hillbox is soft. Now defenders can close that net. This kill should mean them to him. They cannot proceed with the current plan. Oh. Davey! What an acute angle! Four. Oh. Four to come, no! Handy! 14 and 9, and clearly the ever-present star for faith in this grand final. Nade on the other side, wanting to be the annoying oh. brother, and Handy will fall through the hatch. Three versus three. And it's the smokes that are stalling out this push. So W7M have to wait for their moment. It's all directed to the... Ah! No! Three versus one! Is this the moment where we get crowned a new champion, a new dynasty to be created? And Of this round is now here we go out go the smoke canisters kamikaze thinking about going in for that plant moringa yeah. as i said does have an impact finds one can he get himself a second he's being challenged from the door kamikaze gets psk it's looking like it's going in the favor kamikaze he's pushing downstairs he's shut down by palu the diffusers down on the ground it's three versus two as moringa finds one upstairs as well but he's downed it's all down to palu one versus two effectively one versus three as moringa is finished off 14 seconds left to go this is tense c4 he's got a c4 in hand pino takes the drop julio has diffuser in hand he finds the shots but palu cannot find the kill out comes the nitro oh, it's shot, it's shot out. out by pino. pino that is the round in 2020 brazilian hearts were broken but like a phoenix nip rise from the ashes